So we're here at a reservoir in the northern region of Suffolk, very close to Norfolk. So it's a 200,000 cubic metre reservoir for a, a farmer. We started here 23 days ago. We've had two 50 tonne excavators here, three D6 bulldozers, all three with GPS, seven dump trucks. I think we may have got up to eight at one point. But they stripped the topsoil off to the side. The, the lay of the land meant that the cut at the end of the field wasn't particularly deep, but the top where he is now was, uh, was eight metres deep. Total volume of material moved is just over 100,000 cubes. And we're on day 23 and they're nearly done. So I believe we've had one rain off. So the weather has very much been on side as it, as it has most of this summer. But the boys have done incredibly well. Uh, they've been working 12 hour shifts. They've done a couple of Saturdays along the way. That volume and that amount of time is, is uh, really impressive and it's testament to the hard work, the management and uh, you know, the lead driver on site. The trucks have been working efficiently, barely been reversing for the most part of the job, rolling around, compacting the bank as they're building it up. The way they've done the topsoil has meant they've been able to peel it back over quickly. Once they've got the, the first bit of topsoil um, out of the way for the key trench, um, the guys dug four metre wide by sort of one and a half metres on average depth. Um, key trench around the outside of the reservoir, well, actually worked out as being in the centre of where the final embankment on each side is. Um, to get through the land drains, obviously heavy ground like that has land drains all the way through it. So got through all of them, chased them out to make sure that um, they're out of the way. And then engineered the material back in, in layers. Um, and obviously now eventually the bank's built with those key tre the key trench in the centre. Friday will be 23 days when they'll be finished topsoil and um, landscaping the area. 100,000 cubes, so it's not bad going. Uh, and it's all been engineered in, so it's not like we've just been tipping up and thrashing it in. Um, and we're actually assisting the farmer with getting the uh, pipe working, ready to start filling her up over the winter. The kit's been outstanding. We've actually demoed a Caterpillar 50 tonner behind us for the last two weeks as well, which has been interesting. Obviously looking, looking at what we're purchasing next year. Now more than ever, we're looking at cost, um, cost and value and performance. So um, yeah, it's been good. Uh, we've had mostly our kit, a couple of, couple of cross-hire dump trucks where ours have been busy on other work. And yeah, we're hoping to be out, out of here uh, in two days time, topsoiled, compacted and away we go, kit moving to another job.